Om Shanti, welcome back. We are here with 7th of October's Godly Blessing. The power of silence is something which everybody is looking for. Silence is not something which we want when people are not around us. When we have our cell phones off, we don't have any kind of digital communication. That is important, but that is not silence. It's the first step to move towards silence. But still, silence should be there when we are surrounded by everything and everyone around us. When there's chaos around us and at that time, if you have silence in your mind, then you are the most stable mind in the world. Then you are capable of doing something in the world. So this silence is something which is what we're going to talk about in this beautiful Vardhan. God says, may you increase your account of accumulation of the power of silence and have a right to an elevated status. Just as the power of science makes a lot of impact at present and enables you to have temporary attainments, everything around us, even this mobile phone, the laptop and the lights, these are temporary attainments, right? In the same way, increase your account of accumulation of the power of silence. Now, what does that mean? When we are sitting alone with ourselves and when we are thinking, what kind of quality of thoughts are we creating? See, they can be a complete khichdi. I would say a mixture of everything in your mind. You could have thoughts of positivity. You could have thoughts of planning for the future. You could have thoughts of regrets. You have thoughts of greed. You have thoughts of jealousy. You have thoughts of why and why not and blame work and so many things and a little bit of positivity in you. And that itself is completely surrounding your mind and not letting you grow. And that is not silence. It doesn't mean that you are in a place of silence and you have all these thoughts going on in your mind. Silence means you use spiritual power, spiritual knowledge to overcome all these impure thoughts in your mind and make them silent. So, God says, Accumulate power in yourself with the divine drishti of the Father. For only then will you be able to give others what you have accumulated. Now, let's say somebody comes for peace, somebody comes for some kind of guidance from you and you have got so many thoughts going on in your own mind. How can you help somebody else, right? You don't have any clarity in your mind. So God says first have complete silence in your mind. And that can only happen when we don't have too many desires, when we are not greedy, when we are not, when we are not revengeful, when we are not jealous and when we have overcome all these impure negative thought patterns then we have so much of silence in our mind that anybody who comes for help we can easily guide them those who accumulate the power of silence and know the importance of drishti become those who have a right to an elevated status a spiritual sparkle of happiness is visible on their faces because their mind is so full of silence that you can always see them they are always happy they are always gullible they are always always in their highest point in life in terms of happiness not in terms of monetary things only but in terms of happiness not in terms of wealth only in terms of peace not in terms of possessing things they are peaceful within because they have got so much of silence within their mind as compared to the people around them and that's why they're able to help people around that's why they're able to connect to the supreme creator and get his drishti now what is drishti you can learn about this drishti of God when you come at Brahma Kumari Center and do the seven day course. Very nearby you. Om Shanti.